How Handshake DNS Works While Handshake is a blockchain that was specifically built for DNS, it does not seek to decentralize the entire domain name system. Rather, it focuses on decentralizing the storage and control of the DNS root zone, with the ultimate goal of replacing certificate authorities. The root zone is currently controlled solely by ICANN. They, alone, gatekeep who can create and control top-level domains such as .com and .org. Handshake soft forks ICANN's root zone with a decentralized blockchain that is backwards compatible with the existing ICANN top-level domains, this means when you switch your DNS to Handshake to access Handshake domains, you'll still be able to access ICANN websites like Google, Twitter, Wikipedia, and Twitch. For example, when you attempt to visit Google.com, Handshake DNS will recognize that .com is an ICANN TLD and defer to ICANN system. But what about name collisions? A name collision occurs when both Handshake and ICANN have the same top-level domain in their root zones, and can happen if ICANN releases a name that already exists on Handshake. Handshake DNS will ignore new ICANN TLDs by default, but you can always use an alternative version of Handshake DNS and choose to defer to ICANN names if a collision occurs. Browsers and apps that support Handshake will also provide the option to select which systems you want name collisions to settle to, even including other blockchain DNS systems, giving you more power over your browsing experience. You can easily try browsing Handshake now by using community tools such as hns.to, hdns.io, or Fingertip. Try visiting your first Handshake domain at namebase slash with hns.to, changing your DNS settings to visit namebase slash directly, or downloading Fingertip to visit namebase slash trustlessly. Then get started on Handshake by owning your name at namebase.